Welcome to the video, my friends. Oh, Falcon, you sound different. Why is that? Uh, well, you may ask, uh, uh, the title, RTX Voice, NVIDIA RTX Voice, they've released a beta for their voice processing using GPU AI. Now, it's meant for the RTX, but it will work on 1070, 10 series cards. I'm using the 1070 and the 16 series cards, but there is a workaround. It will error out on installed, but you can edit this uh, NVI file. I'll leave links in the description and the walkthrough the, to, to get it to work. Edit a file. Um, the NVI file, delete a single line, and it will uh, work then once you run the setup after that and save the file. So, yeah, um, and then you'll have uh, software based free if you've got an NVIDIA card that will work with to remove background noise. Now, what you're hearing me now is with my Asus ROG Fusion wireless headset um, through the microphone on it. I've just flopped it down and having a go because my 2020 with the DBX preamp it just does a good job anyway, and it doesn't really sound any different. Um, so we're going to do a bit of a clap test. So you can hear the claps here. We're about two feet away from my face. The microphone is on my face, of course. And you can hear the claps while I'm talking. Now, we won't do this too long because it will get annoying, but what we'll do is switch over to, uh, well, just tick the box to remove background noise in the RTX Voice app. we just got to wait for it to enable, and then our claps should disappear. There we go. I'm still clapping. Sometimes it might have a little flid and pick one up, but for the most part, it's, it's getting a lot of noise gone. Right, I'll stop clapping there, and we, we can compare from earlier to now what the audio is like with just me talking with the Asus ROG Fusion wireless headset. It's a great headset for audio in the actual cups. Microphone, not so much. I have done a review of this headset, like I've said in the past. It's uh, I'll leave a card to the headset uh, on the video right here, so you can check out the review if you wish. It's a pretty nice headset for audio. We've got the uh, surround sound on it and everything. Really good awareness of direction in Call of Duty and things like that. Uh, of course, Daisy and Deadside, which I've been playing, are really helpful to know where people are coming from at me, which is really nice and handy. But anyway, this is about microphone quality. So if you want good microphone quality, but you can't afford um, an expensive mic or a preamp to, for, for hardware noise reduction, this is going to be the solution for you. If you've got a GeForce card, that it'll support it 10 series 16 series or an rtx which is what it's meant for hopefully later on down the line as it is in development in beta they will uh add 10 series 16 series as default because i mean if it works it works just let people have it i think if it's going to work the free solution is always a good thing you know if it's free give it me you know what i'm saying it's uh we'll all love it so this is what i'd use if i still had my snowball because i struggled like hell with my snowball but I've only got what I've got because the community was amazing and supported me and gave me, you know, wanted to improve my quality. And, and that's where we are now. So but if you've got a snowball or a headset mic or something like that and you want to improve your quality, give this NVIDIA RTX voice a go. All links will be in the description below. I had no idea this was a thing until Lukage posted it me in Discord. So thank you very much. Huge shout out to Lukage for giving me this information. Give me the scoop on the latest news with NVIDIA. I'm really impressed with this, actually you can actually be a lot more happy with your with your voice on your microphone and people won't moan maybe so much in game because I've, I've heard that when somebody talks they're like well gee you got a shit mic mate so uh yeah hopefully that can uh, avoid that for anybody out there that gets that issue so i was going to do video as well with this but for some reason my logitech will not work my webcam um i've tried it in different usbs and it just says uh reconnect does it doesn't it's not detected so i don't know why that is it's still plugged in now but it won't work I was going to do uh, all, uh, uh, visual. I was going to do a uh, visual uh, clapping, so you could actually see me clapping and what it'd do, and it uh, weren't going to work. So uh, voice it is with just a, an image on the background, just for I don't know something to look at uh, while you're listening to me. Anyway, that's enough talking on this mic. I'll just finish up the video with my 2020 and DBX preamp hardware noise reduction, so you get a comparison between that and the Asus ROG Fusion wireless headset. I'll turn on the noise reduction anyway. I won't clap, but we'll turn it on and you see if it makes a difference. I don't think it does really, but uh, you be the judge. Okay, it's just turning on the noise reduction now. It should be on any second just with my voice. Let me know if it, you heard anything different. Whack that volume up with the AT20 and DBX. It does a good job anyway, like I've said. So um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but great for, for most people out there, I think. That software solution is a must. So uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like. And subscribe if you enjoy the content. Much more videos to come. Get some more dead side. Get back on day Z. Uh, there's a lot more of that to show. I need to get on miscreated. Seven days to die, maybe? I don't know. Let me know in the comments below <laughs> what you'd like to see. I've I have actually got Mountain Blade still to 
check out as well. So there's so much to do. So little time. I got four kids to feed. God damn it. What move is that from? Not exact quote, but, you know, if you know that movie, you're awesome. And, uh, yeah, I, I love you all. And I'll see you peeps next time. Okay, it does kind of like cut my voice out a little bit on my 2020 and DBX. So I think it's a bit overkill maybe for this mic. It does sound a little bit crisper, I'll admit, listening back to this. But uh, I don't know. We'll see the future of RTX and NVIDIA. Again, I love you all and I'll see you peeps next time.